Welcome to my channel. In this episode, I show you how to build an AV adapter for your C64. Um, this adapter was developed by Sven Peterson. I put you the link in the description down below if you want to build your own. With this adapter, you can use a composite cable or S video cable, and you don't need a C64 video cable. And um, it's very easy to build. It's a little bit of soldering, no small components. And uh, if we finished soldering, we put this in a nice 3D printed case, plug this on the TV, and then we can test and see how the image quality. Um, is on the TV. So enjoy the video and let's start it. So here we are. And now we can come to the fun part of this the assembly. Let's start. So let's start with the with these connectors. So Start with the center pin. For the Fourth, I don't have a black one. It's difficult to get this these days, so I use uh, a second white one. So oh. let's see if this line up correctly. Yes. And now we solder the rest of the legs. These are in place, and now we solder the mini DIN connector. Now, before we do this, we need the resistor. So here we have the resistor, three hundred and. 30 ohm resistor. So I'll put this in there. Bend the legs.
Snip the legs off. So, I think the next is we put the jumper on. So, now we have the jumpers and the RCA jacks and the resistor on. Now it's time for the mini bin. You see it fits by its own. So that's also for the last part we need this connector we only need the inside Put it in. You see it fits by its own. Now we use flux. It has in place, sits flush on the board. So that's it for soldering. For the next thing is the test. Test this without the, the case. Then we put it in the case. And then we are finished. So you see, this is 64 in the AV adapter without the um, case. We have here the video input. We plug this in. Then we use the RCA checks for composite. We use my SD2IC. For this video, I put the link in the description too. So now let's see if uh, this build works. Yeah, you see we have a picture. Let's see if we have sound.
Let's try Bruce Lee. You see, we have sound. You see, it works and it's good. Success. The last thing we have to do is to put this in this case. Before I do that, I give you a short explanation about the jumpers. This jumper here is for um, audio in to switch it on or off. Audio in is this one, this jack. I put this in the off position. I don't need an audio in. This switch, this jumper is for mono or stereo output. This uh, C64 that I used is a stock Amiga, is a stock C64, and so mono is is, uh, is good. And this jumper is for the as video output, you can uh, switch this resistor in the signal path. It's a little bit stiff. Yeah, a little bit out of focus. So, it's in the case. And now we're finished. So, this is for this episode. This uh, AV adapter is very useful device and uh, easy to build. To build your own, I put the link in the description. Also from the SD2IC uh, from my last video, you saw on the back of the um, Commodore 64. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you want more of my videos, subscribe to my channel. And so I see you on the next one.